You're listening to the Experiencing God Day by Day podcast, brought to you by Black Community Ministries International. April 6, He made him to be sin. 2 Corinthians 5, verse 21. He made the one who did not know sin to be sin for us, so that we might become the righteousness of God in him. This verse should startle us and cause us to tremble. It is not a verse to be read quickly and passed over. As Christians, we are grateful to be forgiven of our sins. We are thankful we have been adopted as God's children. Yet we will never comprehend the awesome price that Jesus paid to cleanse us of our sin and to give us His righteousness. How abhorrent was it for the sinless Son of God to have every sin of humanity placed upon Him? What love was required for the Father to watch His only Son bear the excruciating pain of our sin upon the cross? The prophet Isaiah summarized the human condition. All of us have become like something unclean, and all our righteous acts are like a polluted garment. Isaiah 64, verse 6. Even the high priest Joshua, in his exalted position among God's people, was clothed in filthy rags before God. Zechariah 3, verse 3. The apostle Paul, who labored arduously to be righteous before God, realized that his most strenuous efforts to please God were no more valuable than rubbish. Philippians 3, verses 4 to 10. The plight of humanity is that nothing we could ever do could satisfy God's desire for righteousness. But the miracle of God's mercy is that God exchanges our filthy clothes for splendid robes of righteousness. Zechariah 3, verse 4. In this awesome exchange, God placed the sin of humanity upon His righteous Son. Jesus became so identified with our sin that Scripture says God made him to be sin on our behalf. The Holy Son of God could not possibly do more for us than this. Experiencing the Father's wrath upon the sin he carried would have been more painful to endure than any human rejection or physical suffering. Never take the righteousness God has given you for granted. Never take the forgiveness of your sin lightly. It cost God a terrible price in order to forgive you and make you righteous. Walk in a manner worthy of the righteousness He has given you. This podcast is based on the book Experiencing God Day by Day by Henry and Richard Blackaby, published by B&H Publishing Group, music by Mark Brown.